A choreographer is responsible for dance and movement in your production, whether it is a theatrical production, a live show, or a music video, or a film. A choreographer doesn't necessarily have to be the greatest dancer, but you have to have a really strong, fundamental understanding of movement and how to tell a story with movement. That's sort of the ABCs of what a choreographer does. Normally how I start is I read the script and if I feel strongly about it, I you know, accept the job and I'll have a conversation with the director. We will talk about their concept for the show, what they see and what they want. Sometimes it's very specific. Sometimes it's come in and create a two minute dance that's for this one scene that is set to this music that's about love or about anger or about you know transgression or whatever the theme is. Sometimes it's a, a lot more abstract where you're sort of coming in and you watch rehearsal and then there will be inspirations or moments of movement and then I'll come in and I'll say, okay, let's do this or let's do that. If you like, I don't mind like, breaking I'd the like fourth to. wall. Yeah. I came into choreography kind of by accident. I was teaching a movement class for actors and a director took my class just because she was interested in that and she came up to me after class one day and she said, will you choreograph my show? And I said, I've never choreographed before and if I did, it wouldn't be the Broadway style choreography. It would be weird. And she said, that's what I want. So I nervously choreographed her show and uh, I was nominated for an Ovation Award uh, here in LA. After that, the doors just kind of opened and it just really started to take off from there. Right now, I am directing uh, a show that I co-wrote called Ratatatical, A Journey in Rhythm. It is a rhythm extravaganza, basically. I'm a big, big proponent and advocate of people going to school to train for the arts. It is a craft, after all. Pick mentors, pick people that inspire you to help you out along the way. To me, a mentor is someone that you are inspired by. They encourage you to keep doing what you do. He or she never has to know that they are my mentor. I just simply look at their work for inspiration. Race and training and sex and type and style have all impacted my ability to get work in this business. However, because I didn't take no for an answer, and because I, no wasn't an answer, actually, because the way I always saw it was, well, what else am I going to do? The important thing for me to do was to carve my own path and to create my own rules. I didn't look right, I didn't dress right, I didn't know the right people, so I had to create my own reality. And I'm going to go out and try and find my people, people that want to see what I'm making. And the internet has made that possible, not just for me, but for you guys too. It's possible for all of us. Three, four, we go.